the joint, man. Have a sustain right here for me, big dog. Good looking out. What's up, y'all? This is Frankie Floyd with the joint. I'm chilling with the man of the hour of the decade. It's your boy, Sugar Free. Sugar Free the pimp. What's up, y'all? What's up, joint? Uh, we right here on the joint doing a damn thing in Hollywood, y'all. For y'all don't know, man, this is a West Coast legend, y'all. He put the pin pimp. He put the pin Pomona. All that, 1997, he had a real hot album with gold with very little promotion, but now he back on those scenes, 2004, right. you know what I mean? What's the, who, who worked on the album, of course, Quick, what's the name of the album? Go ahead and plug that. Uh, quick, quick produced the album, uh, except a couple of songs. Uh, uh, quick, quick worked on the album. Uh, uh, it's called The New Testament, okay, and uh, it's full of game, you know, just like Street Gospel, it's full of game. Any, anytime you buy some sugar free, you know, it's just going to be all about the game. It's, it's going to be sugar free and free as, free as sugar for y'all that do not know. When the album drops? Tomorrow. Tomorrow, March 9th. March it's going to hit you. It's called The New Testament. That's what's up. That's, that's what's up. You know, you're a West Coast icon, hip-hop rapper and whatnot. Back here with Sugar Free, the man of the hour. So you know you're a West Coast artist, West Coast hip hop phenomenon. What you think the biggest misconception that people have about West Coast rap music right now? Uh, I mean, you know, I don't know, man. You know, I just want them to play our stuff. You know what I'm saying? I the first album in '97 was off the hook, Street Gospel. You know, it was your freshman album. You feeling that sophomore drinks, sophomore jinx? So you just gonna come down and put it down like you did the first time? Man, I just went in there and did the best I could. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm just talking about the game. Yeah. You know what I mean? And how and how I'm talking about it is is kind of different. Right. You know what I mean? You know, uh, a little bit more skilled. Okay. You know what I'm saying with my with my slur and my yeah, yeah, we know that. and my we finesse. Know that. You know what I'm know, saying? So yeah. Man, you I ain't gonna hold back the pickles, yeah. lettuce, or the mustard. The pickles and lettuce, they them catchphrases and stuff that y'all be hearing other cats be saying. He's the originator of that, y'all. Don't get it twisted. Man, this is a real pimp, not no assistant uh -huh. pimp. Like some of these cats that be that be talking about their pimps and pimps and stuff. Nah, he was out there on the track, right? Man, all the time. All the time. All the time. All the time. You know what I'm saying? Hey, look at check this man out, man, from the from the feet. You know what I'm saying? Look at this cat. You know what I'm saying? Popping his collar and all that. You know, look at the gators and the suits and tailor made and all that. The company. You know, he's been in the game for real, for real. You know what I mean? You got to keep your tools sharp. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, got to keep your tools have, sharp. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Got to, got to turn them heads, man, right? and have something real, real good exactly. to say. He got the cell phone ringing. This man can't go nowhere. Every two minutes, somebody calling this guy. He about to get on stage and rip it for us, man. So, you know, tear this shit up up here, right here on the joint.